I am Deep Kartika, pursuing final year B.Tech Biomedical Engineering in SRM University and I am presenting the project Segmentation and Classification of Cervical Cancer Cells from Histopathological Images with my group mates J. Lumin Shiba and V. Mohana Priya under the guidance of Ms. Vinupreeta, Assistant Professor, Department of Biomedical Engineering, SRM University. The main aim of the project is to develop a computer-aided system to classify normal and abnormal cervical cells based on features extracted. Objective The main objective of the project is to collect pap smear sample images and to pre-process the sample images and to segment an area of interest and to extract features from the segmented image and finally to classify between normal and abnormal cells based on feature factor. Introduction Cervical cancer can be found in the mouth of the uterus. It is caused by a virus called human papilloma virus which is sexually transmitted. About 70% of cervical cancers are caused by HPV type 16 and 18. In India, it affects 1,32,000 women each year of whom 72,000 women lose their battle with it. According to the cervical cancer pre-coagulation, pap smear is a general screening test performed to detect pre-cancerous and cancerous cells. Gardasil and Cervarix are the two cervical cancer vaccines used to common. Need of the need of the project. Manual method of analyzing pap smear images in bulk quantities consumes more time and it is a workloaded process. Human error may occur due to lack of concentration in manual methods. Therefore, developing a computerized system will be used to overcome these disadvantages. Sample images. We have collected normal uh, pap smear sample images 55, abnormal pap smear images 55 and totally it is done. And the sample images are collected from Kidboy Memorial Institute of Oncology, Bangalore. The stained cervical cell slides are focused under compound microscope with magnification lens 40x and the images are captured using digital camera and it is stored in .bmp format. Proposed methodology. First we have to read the input image and then go for pre-processing to segment the image. Uh, the features can be extracted from the segmented image and finally classify them. Pre-processing. In, in pre-processing, uh, gray conversion and filtering are the two techniques. Uh, gray conversion. Con gray conversion is converting a color image into a grayscale image. Filtering is used to remove noises. Median filter preserves this. Segmentation algorithm. Start the program, read the image using tip file name, convert RGB image into gray image using RGB to gray command. Remove noise by median filter using MET filter to command. Perform histogram of gray image using IMHIST command. Assign LMAX equal to 256 for performing intensity calculation of histogram. Assign threshold values for following to find HM best image. Maximum attempt equal to 25,000. HS size equal to 50. HM acceptance rate equal to 0.95. PA rate equal to 0.5. Segment the image using SEC command. Segmentation flowchart. This flowchart explains the same procedure as mentioned in segmentation algorithm. We have shown the output images of normal sample in this slide. The image on the left side shows the original input image and the image on the right side shows the matter image. And this slide is for abnormal image. This is a comparison between normal segmented image and abnormal segmented image which shows some difference. Feature extraction. Area, we have performed area, diameter, perimeter, number of objects, mean, geometric mean, standard deviation, peak signal, noise ratio. Feature, ex feature extraction algorithm. Crop the segmented image using IM crop command. Convert into binary image using IM to VW command. Clear border of the binary image using IM clear command. Label the image using VW label command. Find the area using VW area command. Find the diameter from the area value. Find the perimeter from the diameter value. Find the number of objects using NUM objects command. Find the following values from segmented image. Mean using mean to command. Geometric mean using core to command. Standard deviation using STD to command. Peak signal noise ratio using PSNR command. Future extraction algorithm. Feature extraction flowchart. This flowchart explains the same procedure as mentioned in the feature extraction algorithm. This is the output table of features extracted. Uh, the, the area, diameter, perimeter and number of objects shows uh, better difference between normal and abnormal images. Similarly, mean geometry means standard deviation and peak signal noise ratio is also lower in normal images and higher in abnormal images. 
number of objects uh, shows very large difference between normal and abnormal images. Classifier, neural network. Open NPR tool, load input and target files, train the system and plot confusion matrix, ROC plot and performance graph. Classifier flowchart explains the same procedure as before in the classifier algorithm. This is the output of classifier and this image shows the all confusion matrix. From this matrix we can gain the following values true positive as 37, true negative as 54, false positive as 18, false negative as 1, accuracy 82.7%, sensitivity 67.3%, specificity 98.3%, Precision 97.4%. This is the ROC graph of the output. Uh, in this, we are gaining uh, accuracy value above the average accuracy value. Receiver operating characteristic analysis is an established method of measuring diagnostic performance in medical imaging studies. This graph is the performance graph. We are getting more uh, testing uh, value than the validation and training value. Yes. Conclusion. This work presents a method of threshold based texture segmentation and feature extraction based on morphological operations to classify normal and abnormal cervical cells using neural network back propagation algorithm. The texture segmentation gives better output for cancer images. Feature extraction based on morphological operations reveals a better difference in area, diameter, perimeter and number of objects values between normal and abnormal cells. The classification based on features extracted gives precision of 97.4% sensitivity as 67.3%, specificity as 98.3% and the accuracy rate is 82.7% which is more than the average accuracy comparing with the collected clinical data. Future work In the future work, filter based texture segmentation can be used to segment the image and support vector admission, k-mean clustering or convolution neural network CNN classifiers can be used to check the various accuracy levels. This is the literature review we have referred. Thank you.